Some artists have followers, other artists have followings. What is the difference and which one is better? I'm Brendan Varan with DJ Booth and this is the Booth Review. Artists these days are obsessed with building large social media followings. There is no better way to directly connect with your fans. But big numbers mean very little if they fall on deaf ears. For example, look no further than Designer, who has 1.5 million followers on Twitter. Earlier this year, the good music rapper responsible for the smash hit Panda asked his followers for 50,000 retweets in exchange for the release of his new single. Unfortunately for Designer, over 72 hours later, the tweet had not even hit 2,000 retweets, which means that a big name artist with over a million fans on Twitter could not even get 2,000 people to simply press retweet in exchange for new music. Now, it's not all designers' fault. Achieving 50,000 retweets is a task even for established artists. But it goes to show you that having a million followers on a social media platform does not mean that a million people are dying to hear your new shit. Now, on the flip side, we have Arizona rap trio Injury Reserve, who have roughly 15,000 Twitter followers. Now, Injury Reserve recently set out on a 28-date domestic tour as the headlining act, and many of those dates are already sold out. One of the group's members, Richie with a T, recently sent out a tweet that reminded not only fans, but other artists, that it's a real connection with real people, not empty digits on an app, that is the true catalyst for building a fan base ready and willing to support. Now, with many artists being signed today by major labels based off cultural relevance and Instagram followers, basically clout, it's easy to understand why many up and coming artists are confused about what really matters most. But as Richie pointed out, an artist or group will almost always see greater longevity and financial gain with a small but loyal following and not a bloated artificial follower count on Twitter. Simply put, a real world following and internet followers are not the same thing. Follows are great, retweets are awesome, but what's way better is somebody buying a concert ticket and a piece of merch. A million followers is a good look, but good looks don't pay the bills. Do you know an artist that doesn't have a huge social media following, but you know for a fact would sell out a show instantly? Let us know in the comments. My name is Brendan Varan, and this is The Booth Review. What up, squad? I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, you can hit the subscribe button. You can also follow us on Twitter and Instagram by clicking the links below. Until next time, thanks for watching all deaf music.